this is liquid ocelot and uh, I have some very good news for everybody guys uh, today I was uh, uh, somebody on reddit uh, I shared a problem uh, for command and conquer rivals and the problem was that if you can see the previous video uh, I cannot see full graphics uh, using uh, memo play and blue stacks uh, like uh, the health bars you see they are very very small so what I did was uh, uh, on this reddit post um, I'll go to this reddit post and then I'm going to show you step by step I wrote this reddit post I tried everything OpenGL uh, to get OpenGL to work on any emulator tried Nox, Memoplay, Bluestacks and help gave all the uh, stuff but uh, then this friend of mine I'll give a huge shout out to him the Grim Ash he told me go LD player and do it max so I tried let's see the results uh, the results are astonishing for me because I was planning to buy a new laptop but uh, somehow shockingly it's uh, very good news first of all uh, what you need to do as the title suggests um, how to uh, best emulator wait let me read it best emulator to run command and conquer rivals on high end PC uh, this is the title and I'm going to show you exactly what I mean by that this is not clickbait so what you need to do is uh, first of all download uh, this uh, link is in the description LD player from ldplayer.net once you have downloaded it second step is right click on your um, uh, desktop go to Nvidia control panel even though this step is not uh, compulsory you can uh, get this done but still I would like you to do that in the global settings uh, you have to do two changes open GL rendering GPU you have to choose uh, your GPU card and also uh, you have to uh, go to texture filtering quality now you have to go and use high quality on this option and then save it now uh, thing is that uh, if if I were you I would also go to program settings and now I'm going to um, uh, go to add uh, LD player where is yes DN player here it is now uh, add selected program you see add selected program uh, high quality you see and uh, uh, open GL rendering so this is already done okay now I'm going to click cross and now let's see the results I'll open LD player and here uh, the settings uh, these three uh, lines I'll go to settings uh, on the dropout down menu you see my graphic card have been detected even if you are on ATI Radeon card it will be detected so I'll go to settings I have chosen 1920 multiplied by 1080p to 80 dpi and now I'm going to go for four cores and RAM I'm going to uh, maximize it to RAM I'm going to maximize it to this this RAM and you see this this is one of the settings the other settings is the game settings the most important one uh, enable vertical sync I have enabled it and uh, resolution I have taken 1080p for 750 Ti cards and 1080p resolution over here as well now I'm going to save it and restart it it's too cold over here I'm really sorry I'm breathing heavily and uh, I have a uh, bad uh, uh, cold flu so uh, now I have already I tried even installing Fortnite but uh, it isn't working as this is also not a 64-bit emulator so I'm going to uninstall this and uh, going to open rivals now you see there is a massive difference in the graphics a big big difference and without proof uh, I will lose my legitimacy so I'll have to show you the gameplay guys uh, for you guys to see yourself uh, uh, proof 
everything the music is fine I think you guys cannot hear the music though uh, because I'm on uh, screen uh, uh, screen recorder Electa and I haven't chosen the right options so I'll ju I'm just in the training league I had to make a new account but I can retrieve all my account information from the other accounts as well it's easy for me see the graphics I'll try to I'll try to go full screen just to show you guys full screen settings full screen where is full screen uh, wait wait yes this is it f11 same uh, same as for blue stacks so wait for everything see now it's in full screen so I'll go war factory you see these bars over here you see these bars now I'll go for Rhino and uh, let's see if uh, the bar health bar shows I want yes the health bar is showing you see health bar is showing for both the infantry as well as the Rhino unit and uh, also the building health bars is being showed so this means that the emulator this emulator is perfect somehow it's uh, gathering all the data from um, from every graphics all the graphics are perfect the um, I'll uh, just finish this game off and uh, try to finish it off as much as, as quickly as possible to be honest Now I can see the health bar. It's so helpful to be honest. So helpful to see the health bar. I can play properly now. it's so easy for me to play I can see ultra high graphics over here no shenanigans just like promised machine gun has done some imperious damage somehow So I had to show you all the graphics and also I'm going to show you uh, as you can see all the text on the screen as well. So I'm going to have to show you my main main menu. Everything is um, is open like I can see home. I'll just enter my new name maybe liquid ocelot hashtag hashtag youtube so this is my third account I'll do all the other things later but look at this play as GTI reach level 9 I can read all the text everything and uh, from my uh, you see the text is uh, clearly visible so this is the best emulator for uh, your uh, for getting it to run on full graphics as the settings I showed you I know some of you guys will say that we are already getting these graphics on uh, BlueStacks but uh, for me BlueStacks wasn't working I tried it and it couldn't uh, pick up OpenGL. I hope you liked and enjoyed this video. Please, please, please share this video with everybody, with your friends and um, like and comment.
uh, if you didn't like the video dislike it as well and uh, uh, let me know in the comment section what you guys think and uh, what you guys experienced thank you so much i'll be signing off take care